Melania Trump first arrived in the United States from her native Slovenia back in 1996. And now, two decades later, she is facing the prospect of becoming first lady. Melania had long been a fixture on the modeling scene, beginning her career at just 16 in her native country of Slovenia. She was born in Sivnica, a small town in Slovenia. The official program handed out to all the delegates here at the convention details Melania's life story, including the fact that, quote, after obtaining a degree in design and architecture at university in Slovenia, Melania was jetting between photo shoots in Paris and Milan. But her website falsely claimed that she did graduate from college in Slovenia, a website that has since that mistake has been discovered was eliminated. Website just wiped out, destroyed, gone, doesn't exist. It appears Melania Trump has put Slovenia on the map, even though she hasn't lived there in years. Tourists are now flocking to the small European country where Melania grew up, went on to become an international model. If we are going to have naked models inside this country, they need to be American. Okay, we can't have these Slovenians coming in here taking good, hardworking American jobs like naked models. Would you mind if Slo people from Slovenia were stopped if they looked funny? Well, I think everybody needs to have papers, you know, and uh, be legally here. She's now a U.S. citizen. She became a U.S. citizen after, a year after marrying Donald Trump, but that she had to go back to Slovenia after several months to make sure she got a stamp in her visa. Modeling in the United States using a, a B-2 visitor's visa or a B-1 business visa, uh, based on her trips uh, to get the visa renewed, uh, that would have been in an airport, not actually in Slovenia. Will bringing up Melania help Donald Trump with women voters? Oh yeah, Trevor. Because if you want to appeal to everyday American women, bring out a Slovenian supermodel to help make your case. Because oh, imagine what he would be saying about himself. He'd be like, they come in here, they're stealing our men. Yeah, they're stealing all our men, women from Slovenia. Can you even be president if your wife wasn't born here? I don't know, I'm just asking. Clearly, I don't hate immigrants. <laughs> yes, I know he's pro-immigration because I was in Slovenia and Donald saw a picture of me in a magazine that he called me and said, hey, come to America. That's very true. And they say, I can't come, you crazy old man. I don't have green card. And he says, screw green cards. They're for poor people. Just get over here. Hey, 